What's going on, my motherfucking? Who am I doing? I'm going to do. Ooh, I'm gonna do Gemini's. What's going on, my Gemini's? What's going on, my Gemini's? It's your good sis, Lava the Empress, and for those who are new to my channel, I give that spiritual tea and see what's going on in your life. What kind of advice I can give to you at this time? Make sure you subscribe to my shit, bro. Please <laughs> subscribe to me because if I reach a thousand, then I can give you guys a free reading. So let's get that free, free. Who don't like free shit? Subscribe to me so you can be one step closer into getting that free reading. <laughs> but anyway, um, even though this is like a low key free reading, but fuck it, you can get a more personalized one. Without further ado, my Gemini's, let's get right into it and see what's going on, what advice I can give to you at this time. Show me Gemini energy right now. Okay. Yep. I knew it. <laughs> Show me Gemini in love. Mm -hmm. This is so hilarious to me. Honestly. Show me Gemini in career. Interesting. Wow. Don't worry, I'm gonna tell you guys. I know they like, I know you guys like, what the fuck? What is it saying, bitch? What is it saying? <laughs> Hold on. Give me the overall advice for Gemini. Say last spirit. Ooh, at the bottom of the deck. We have the devil, le devil, okay? And that just lets me know. You could, I just feel still like, you still feel a little bound, okay, to somebody. Something that is toxic or that you recognize is toxic, it just keeps popping up in your life, in your energy, in your space, Gemini. Something toxic here. I feel like the energy that you are in, you feel like you are putting in all this work right now, and I feel like you are doing the work. You are in this energy of doing the motherfucking work but you're feeling a little doubtful. You're feeling a little like, when is this gonna happen? Impatient, I'm hearing. Longing, you're longing for better. You're hoping and you're praying and you're wishing and you're doing the work and you're doing this and it's like, when, when, when? I'm putting in this work, so when will it happen? And that's that mindset that's keeping you in this page of swords energy, in this defense mode. Because you're not even giving yourself time to just be. Gemini, give your yourself time to just be. Fuck the win. Fuck the win. Live in the now. What's up with now? What you doing now? Yeah, you putting in that work. Are you happy? Do something that make you happy. I don't make it. Eat ice cream. I don't know. What makes you happy? But fuck the win. Because maybe you, it also um, creates these negative thoughts for you that Maybe it's not going to happen because I'm doing the work and I don't trust that it will come to me. Moving on, when it comes to love, you guys have so much love to give. You guys are just ready to give somebody. I'm hearing a new motherfucker. I just heard that in my head. <laughs> a new motherfucker. <laughs> so you guys are probably ready for somebody new, but you're definitely ready to give your love to somebody. I feel like you guys are definitely 
emotionally maturing right now in this day. Definitely in your power when it comes to your emotions. You can have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio in your moon, in your Mercury, in your Mars, in your Venus rising. But I do see here that um, you guys are just emotionally maturing, really recognizing the things that you want and you don't want and really being, you know, just more in tune with yourself emotionally. That's what I'm seeing when it comes to love. Most of you guys are single. And if you are in a relationship, like I said, you're just getting um, more emotionally in tune with yourself making time for yourself, learning yourself. As far as career, I feel like there's going to be a major shake up, okay? It could be anything. It could be um, definitely stepping into your power, getting promoted in some way, which is going to make create a lot of haters in your workspace probably, a lot of whispers of why are he, she getting promoted. Some of you are leaving your job to step into your power, to step into the things that you really want to do. You finally made a decision to change what it is that you know and that you're used to and really step into your, into this um, logical state and stepping into your power, I'm hearing, and having some type of authority Taking control over your finances. Taking control over your life. The overall advice is to move the motherfuck on. And to keep moving on, Gemini. The overall advice is to leave everything that you know. And it's okay. You have your ancestors have your back. You have the divine's permission to walk away walk away from that mindset walk away some of you like I said are leaving <laughs> some of you guys are leaving something so that you can step into your power and take more control of your life that's what I'm hearing here so the advice is to walk away let's see let's get more messages Get more messages for my Gemini. Yeah. Yeah, retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. You guys are definitely walking away. You might be planning a vacation. You could be trying to travel some. Look at this. Love yourself first, you guys. What did I motherfucking say? You guys are choosing to be more emotionally in tune, emotionally mature, learning yourself, stepping into your power and taking control over your life. And the advice is to love yourself because you guys, you guys are not trusting. We have this trust here in reverse. You guys are not trusting in divine timing. And Spirit is saying this situation is calling for you to have faith. Okay? Yeah. We got express your love in reverse as well. Which lets me know that you guys are not speaking to somebody. Or not expressing yourself to somebody. Or you feel like you're holding back your emotions at this time. Trying to take a more logical approach. Time, trying to think more logically rather than with your emotions at this time, Gemini. Let's get um, some channel messages for you. Yep. Perfect. Now let's see what the spirit has to say. I'm obsessed with you. So this negative entity, whatever it may be, this negative energy, I wouldn't even say negative. Somebody's obsessed with you, okay? That, I'm going to just leave it at that. If you think they're not obsessed, they are. They are obsessed with you. Maybe you're obsessed with this person too, but 
They're obsessed with you. Don't be fooled. Let's open up the red one. Fall back. Spirit is saying fall the fuck back, you guys. Move on and fall back. You guys are already falling back, I'm hearing. Definitely falling back, my Geminis. Falling back, taking a step back, re-evaluating and moving in a different direction, I'm hearing. Yeah. Big changes. What the fuck did I just say? Moving in a different direction. Big changes here are on the way for you. Gemini, yeah, you're making big changes in your life because you're taking back your power, you're taking control over your life. Release your ex, yeah, you guys are definitely trying to release your ex. You're moving forward, you're leaving the past in the past. That's it. You tried, you've waited, you've longed for, but it's like, whatever now. Let me open up this blue one. Surprise event. Yeah, something is going to happen for you guys. I feel like spirit is going to surprise you in some way or something is going to definitely come into your path. It's going to be a surprise. Maybe this person is going to surprise you. Or I feel like something is going to happen in the perfect timing. You could be just walking to the store or some shit. I don't know, but some surprise event is going to happen. So... I mean, I can't say look forward to it because, you know, it won't be such a surprise. You got a surprise to look forward to. Last message is, it's up to you. So what you what are you going to do? So Spirit said, it's up to you. So what are you going to do? You know how you want your life to be, Gemini. It's really up to you. You're going to move in a different direction or you're going to stay with what you know and try to fill up everybody else's cup or are you going to start over are you going to take control over your life or are you going to continue to be in this energy of lack or feeling like you don't have enough and so you're working hard because you feel like you don't have enough to give or you, you're missing out on something you let me know in the comment section below um, make sure you subscribe to my channel, please. I'm trying to get to a thousand so that I can give live readings to you guys and interact with you guys, really, because I really do enjoy that. Um, without further ado, it's your good sis, Lava the Empress. And I hope that this resonated with somebody. If it did, like I said, leave a comment in the comment section below. And I'll see you in your next video. Bye, Gemini.